Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Aria's Story. The guy at the repair shop while fucking up my laptop suddenly mad magically made my mic slightly better edition. In the last episode, we had an encounter with the narrator and she revealed a lot while simultaneously revealing very little. So basically, she is going to be waiting for us at the end of, the, of the, at the end of this area and it's up to Arya and Lewin to go find her and find out what the fuck is up. Have you ever tried to write a horror book? I tried, but it's hard to write one. I'd like to try it again when I have more experience. Yeah, I can imagine trying to spook the reader. Okay. What is... Stuffed rabbit fell off and is, uh, bleeding. Door's locked. What? I don't think we have a key. Do we have a key? No, yeah, keys are automatically used, so do I have to look for one on the bookshelf? Oh wait, there's stuff over here. It's very dark. Store up. Uh huh? What's wrong? My head hurts. I think this is what happened to the narrator. Maybe it's just exhaustion. Don't worry, I'm fine. Why don't you rest a bit? I'll find the key to this door. <sighs> I don't want to stay here and do nothing. That's not fair. Take this. You obtained Lewin's knife. A knife? You'll be able to protect yourself if something happens. I'm gonna look for the key. I'll be back soon. Don't ignore me! Oh, I need to let you know about something. If you see a pink door, don't open it. If you open it, I'll be very angry with you. <gasps> Why? Don't open it, that's all. Now that you mentioned it, you have to tell me about it. <sighs> I told you to rest. Oh, did you just push her? Don't be rude, Lewin. I'll be right back. Arya, remember, he wants to- Oh, we're playing as Lewin. Do we- Oh, cool! He- he has- he has his own friggin... Uh... Menu sprite now. So let's start a new save. There's history books on this bookshelf. The author's books are always very good. I should recommend one to Arya. Aw, he does care. Oh, hello. Statue is blocking the door. Like it always does, apparently. There's spikes on that there floor, so, uh... Yeah, that's not happening. Mm hmm. in here. Is this a... Is, is that a pink door? First, let's find out what's in this room first. I really like these books. They were a big inspiration to me. Huh. Actually, I wonder. Does he... Oh. He only has a quill. I thought he had a crossbow earlier. The thorns of these roses are very sharp and I can't go through. Damn, if only we had a little pink bottle. I'm sorry, that's a reference to another RPG Maker horror game. Oh, a cat. I think they're fascinating creatures. Cats are nice. Okay, so yeah, what's in here? I see a beautiful moon shining through the window. Oh, it's a window. I thought it was like, I don't know. I don't know, I just thought I could do something. Okay, so anything through here? No? Hmm. Actually, there was something back in there. Was that just like a light, or... Yeah, it's just a light. Hmm. 
So we have two pathways that are blocked. One is blocked by spikes. One is blocked. Well, one is blo the other is blocked by nature spikes. So. Hmm. Ari is resting. I don't want to disturb her. Okay. So. I guess when in doubt, check the bookshelves, or unless there's like another door down here. Unless I can like, I don't know, stab the statue in the eye. No? No. Okay. Oh wait. Did I look in here already? No, I didn't! There's a coffin here. Hello. Is this, is, is, is this awake? I need your help. Could you help me? I'm busy. I don't have the time to help you. Wait, you're the only one that can help me. <sighs> ah, fine. I'm an old book. My pages are worn and the title of my cover has been erased. Could you write it again? My title is very important to me. Sorry, I can't help you. I have a quill, but I don't have any ink. I can't do it. Please help me. <sighs> uh, I'll try, but I can't promise you anything. Okay, so I guess we gotta find ink now. It looks like wine, but it's actually blood. Oh. How would you know that other than, like, I don't know, the way it smells? Can I use my ink? Can I use my quill on the blood? No? Okay. Hmm. Okay, so. We need to find. Inkwell. Oh, hello. This statue wasn't here before. It sure wasn't. Let's go save. Now that Arya is no longer the playable character, you get to experience the full brunt of my paranoia, Lewin. Okay, let's let's find out what's in here. Books! That's a huge book! What the hell? Oh, I can push it. I can push it. I can push the book. Do I need to push the book down here? Possibly. Yes. Yes, I do. So let's see if I can't leave and then come back and possibly unfuck that. There we go. And then... No? Hmm. Oh, wait. Oh, higgledy fucking piggle, piggledy. Okay. Attempt number two. Push. 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 Oh yeah. There's a pair of scissors on the table. I don't know what good that'll do, but hey. I mean, it's a defense weapon. Seriously, I actually ri Ooh, that's not good! Ooh, let's save. For the 90th time. We're not gonna like cut up the book. In fact, we should we could probably use these scissors on the rose bush. Yes, let's just cut the roses. Cut the thorns off them. Give them to Arya. That would be a nice present and perk her right up. Okay. Is that ink? Yes, ink pot. Gimme. The quill and ink, you've got you've gotten the quill and ink. Nice. Where's the- there we go. Save again. 
seriously, if you're ever really bad about saving, you need to, like, burn the importance of it into your head. RPG Maker horror games are really good, especially this in the witch's house. Write the title of the book. Are you going to help me? Thank you. The title of my cover is Dracula. Oh, don't move. I'm gonna write it. <laughs> that tickles. Can't write it if you stop, and I can't write it if you don't stop moving. I've never actually read the original Bram Stoker's Dracula. I'm finished. Sorry, my hand is in my my hand is injured, and I can't write well. Don't apologize. This is perfect. Thank you. I feel young again. I do like Castlevania, however. I actually recently got to play Symphony of the Night despite missing out on it. It was pretty great. Thank you. I feel young again. Is that it? All the, also, because that's Dracula, I guess I would explain why there are wine glasses full of blood on the table. Oh. Oh, there's a switch inside. Boop. Nice. Let's go save again. There's a key on the wall! Yoink! I got the key. Now I gotta get back to Aria. Why did the music stop? Okay, never mind. There it is again. Go chasing that white rabbit, Alice. The book went through this door. Oh no. Oh, oh, we're playing as Arya again. Oh boy. What's this? What does this say? Horror. Yeah, thanks, I know. What is this place? This place feels very different. This place connects all the other areas of the library to each other. You can go to any area from here. Huh. Neat. Also, I see a pink door. At least I'm pretty sure that door's pink. However, only one door of the horror area is open. I see. Do you see that pink door? That's the center of the library. It's a very special place. Hmm. Reverse, reverse psychology tells me to open it. But the fact that, you know, Lewin still wants to kill me, and he's slowly becoming not wanting to kill me. I want to keep exploring this place. Damn it, Arya! Lewin no longer probably wants to kill you. You should probably fucking... Uh, question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh boy. But yeah, fucking Lewin is slowly becoming less willing to kill you. Why would you betray his trust and go through the fucking one door? He's just like, hey, can you not? What does this guy have to say? I wanted to visit a friend who lives in the romance area, but the door's closed. Aww. Do we just have, like, no choice? Oh wait, there's something over here. What? Okay, never mind, it's a door and it's locked. And I'm guessing there's, like... Yeah, there's really no place to look for a key, so... Hmm. I guess we have to. Lewin told me I shouldn't go to it, but I think I should explore every nook and cranny of this place. What should I do? I should think before making a final decision. Don't. What are you doing here? Lewin? Did you open this door? I told you not to open it! I didn't open it! You didn't open it? Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Take this. I found the key to that door. I want to give you back the knife. By the way, are you feeling better? I'm fine. 
glad to hear that. I may do an extra bit at the end of the episode where I reload that save and open the door. Now, now you've got me curious, Lewin. Damn it! Let's let's make a separate save, and I'll reload that save at the end of the episode, and we'll and we'll and we'll see what the dealio is. What are you looking at? I think I saw a rat behind this book. A rat? Ugh. You can't live here! A bookshelf is a place where the books live, not rats! Hey, out of the way! It might bite! Uh, do- okay. Hmm. But, uh, yeah, rats are actually really sweet and kind of adorable once they're domesticated. Hey, can you not? Here, just this door. Okay. I get the feeling something big is up ahead. Yep. There she is. I'll see if I can remember my narrator voice. <coughs> <clears throat> Finally, they reached the end of the horror area. As she had promised, she showed them. Her true appearance. You put on glasses. Uh. Narrator? I am not a narrator. I am only a human. A boring human. In fact, I was so boring that nobody wanted to be my friend when I was little. Everyone ignored me. That is the reason I decided to copy the personalities of the characters and books I liked. I thought I would become an interesting person and I could have friends. But now, I am not sure which parts of myself are real and which parts are, well, no, which parts are things I copied from books. Narrator does not exist. She is only one of the personalities I copied. I am sure that you do not comprehend anything I am saying. I am sorry for saying such strange things. Aria. You're a girl that loves books and spends a lot of time reading them. A bookworm. Lewin also adores books, but he enjoys writing them. He's a very talented writer. My real talent is not being a narrator, even though it is something similar. I am a storyteller. My duty is to tell and is to tell tales to other people, especially children and old people. A storyteller. Then why did you narrate what I was doing? Mm. I do not know the answer. I'm just doing a favor to someone. A person asked me to narrate everything you did, but I do not know the true purpose. There's someone else in this library, right? Yes, that is correct. There is someone else. <gasps> There's someone else trapped in this place? Who? Someone you both know very well. Do you mean... It can't be. Yes. I must apologize. While I was acting as narrator, I said cruel things, especially to Arya. I am duly sorry for that. It doesn't matter. I'm sure you had your reasons for doing it. But I don't want you to say you're a boring human. You're really, you're really a very interesting person. It's not your fault others couldn't appreciate how marvelous you are. Thank you. These words are very nostalgic. Uh, uh, Arya? Huh? Your head keeps hurting? That is the same that happened to me before. Maybe I'm also trying to remember something. Mm. I see. Arya, there is something very important you must know. Uh. Wait. Arya? truth is... Please don't tell me she's gonna die right before she says it. 
What's happening? Huh? I'm disappearing? No, it, it can't be! I understand. I am not necessary in this story anymore because I decided to stop acting as a narrator. Or maybe I am disappearing because I should not tell her the truth. Do not worry. I will be fine. Keep advancing until the end. I'm sure we will meet again. Dahlia. That is my true name. No. Why? This never should have happened! Arya, we've got to hurry. We need to find the other person that's inside the library. Lillian? Huh? Dahlia. Library. Huh? What are you saying? Books. <laughs> oh. Oh, jeez. That's not good. Also, my cries of exhaustion and or terror need some work. <coughs> Uh-oh. This is the conversation from the beginning, I think. And I think I know whose voices I need to do for this. I finished reading the book. What do you think about it? I loved it. Your books are always my favorites. Is that so? I'm glad to hear that. But... One day you should write a happy ending. Happy endings aren't my specialty. How do you know? You've never tried to write one. Mm. Oh! Hmm? I'll help you write a happy ending. Uh, Arya? Thank you, but you suck at writing stories. Eh, that was very rude. Oh, it's getting late. I should get going. It's true. You should go home before it gets dark. See you tomorrow. See you. <sighs> Sorry, Lewin. I think I fainted. But I need to tell you something important. Uh-oh. <gasps> Lewin? Lewin, where are you? Maybe he disappeared too. Is this all my fault? Dahlia. Lewin. <laughs> oh. Oh no, don't cry, Arya. <laughs> no. I don't want to cry. I have to be strong. I must be brave. The story isn't over yet. Hello. <gasps> What's this? A letter? You've attained Lewin's letter. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. I decided to get to the next area while you were sleeping. There's something I want to see with my own eyes. You're smart and strong, so I have no doubt that you'll be able to get to the end without my help. It's been fun being by your side. I'm so glad I got to know you, Lewin. Oh boy. The final chapter. I think we're gonna do this next time on Let's Play Arya's Story. But before we do that, before we do that, reverse psychology's a bitch. Let's see. Let, let, let's see what lies beyond. Eh? This is my room. Why is my room in this place? This is the center of the library. It's very practical. You can access any area from your room. But this is only a copy. Your real room is in your world. Huh. Just 
is my favorite game. My book collection! Jesus, woman! You have more books than I do! These don't fit on my bookshelf, so I have to put them on the floor. this? A photo? Uh, no, I don't understand. This is impossible. I don't remember this. <gasps> My head. <laughs> it hurts so much. Oh no. Are you okay? Uh, Wait, I'm going to go look for help. You don't need to do that. I'm fine. We've obtained the photo. Let me take you to the exit. Hope you feel better soon. I can't look at it. Piss. What are you doing here? Lewin. Did you open the door? I told you not to open it. Huh? Answer me! Did you open the door? Yeah. What did you say? I was surprised to see my room, but I didn't see anything strange. Did you see anything that caught your attention? No, I didn't see anything. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Take this. I found a key to that door. Okay. I want to give you back the knife. Ah, uh, by the way, are you feeling better? I'm fine. I'm glad to hear that. Can I not look at the photo? Damn it! Okay, so, uh... Yeah, I don't know if I should, like, reload the save and, like, keep this photo or go on with this save or something like that. Uh, fucking... I guess we'll find out next time. Uh, let me know. Let me know in the comments, actually. So, I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Arya's Story, and take care. Thanks for sticking around till the end. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like, a comment, or maybe even subscribing and hitting that subscribe bell. If you want to see more of my content, there are some recommendations for you on screen right now. See you soon!